Sugwana Robinson is an assistant product manager for PEO Soldiers, Soldier Clothing and Individual Equipment at Fort Belvoir, Virginia. She's one of many civilians working for PEO Soldier. Recently, her job had her travel to Fort Bragg, North Carolina to take part in an RFI. RFI stands for Rapid Fielding Initiative and is designed to get soldiers scheduled for deployment, equipped for the rigors of their mission, wherever that might be. Women have always been a part of the Army's mission and their role continues to expand, and so does the focus on female-specific equipment. The most recent offering is the female version of the flame-resistant Army combat uniform. So I was there to educate, um, to inform, um, to get questions on ways to make it better, to get feedback. You know, some of them were positive, there were a few that were negative, and to take that feedback and we're going to collect data from these female soldiers while they're deployed and see if there's things that we can make better or to improve the uniform. Being flame resistant is an obvious enhancement, but the changes don't stop there. Well, because the Army and DOD as a whole wants to make sure that every soldier has the best fit. You know, not just here's a uniform that everybody can wear, unisex. If they can get an optimal fit for every soldier, then that's the goal. So everyone is, deserves like the best or the best equipment. So giving a female soldier a better fitting uniform was the goal. Soldiers put a lot of trust in the equipment they are issued. Along with that, it helps having some veteran experience as a force multiplier. But one thing about being a former soldier, it allows me to reach the, the soldiers very quickly, although they look at me now and they see, you know, a civilian. But once I start asking questions or, or talking to them, I can get to questions pretty quickly, very pointedly, you know, because they, there's a little respect there. So it does, it's a benefit. There are a number of benchmarks that must be achieved preparing soldiers for deployment, equipping the complete force with the right equipment is job number one. Reporting for PEO Soldier from Fort Bragg, North Carolina, I'm Ron Lee.